Prominent All Progressive Congress APC Chieftain Joe Iboku has expressed dismay over the skyrocketing costs of rice in Nigeria. In a social media post on Tuesday, Iboku shared a bag of rice now says that now a bag of rice costs uh, over 100,000 naira. And he said, Men and women, men and women that will rescue Nigeria or rec rescue this country from self inflicted pains and tears are not yet born. He said, Men and women that are supposed to rescue Nigeria from all these uh, inflicted pains and tears, self by who self inflicted pains. Who inflicted the pains instead of him to say it? But if not say he won't talk to IPOB now or Igbo people now or he won't talk to Obina, he go call line yaba, call line yaba anyhow, no reservation or whatsoever. But now instead make it call 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 Inubu name that he has been he has been defending and supporting. He can't. No, he can't. Even when Buari was there, he, he couldn't. He's not telling us about a box of rice. It's now hundred thousand naira. And this post has sparked a wave of reactions online, highlights the growing economic strain on every day Nigeria. <laughs> mm. Every day Nigeria due to rising food prices. Igbokwe's Facebook post said, When all the rice meals we have in Nigeria, my wife just told me that, uh, with all the rice meals that we have in Nigeria, that his wife just told him that uh, the bag of rice is now 100,000. And so the men, the people who are so, so go to save Nigeria are not yet born. Say who they are all over the place because you guys will not allow them to be. You will not allow them because of a uh, selfishness. So tell me, where has your selfishness, where has it taken you to? Where has it taken all of you to? Where has it taken all of you to? Hmm. Sorry, Oga. So, your Tinubu cannot do it again. No, he can't do it again. No. Ask for CVs and you will be shocked. What of your children and grandchildren? You hear this, man? Now, now you can't know. Now, now you know. He said, without sounding immodest, I am constrained to say that the men and women that will rescue Nigeria from these self inflicted pains and tears are not yet born. Yes, with all the rice meals that we have. So, because of rice, somebody was asking him yesterday that day. So, at your age, you see they discuss marketing with the, with your wife. Why you don't go discuss that? Now people will say they get the money nyafu nyafu. They 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 you just they dip her and the people will feel they dip that kind of hand. Even that goes to say no feel just they dip her inside in in capital. Just they dash her hands. Now only politicians and ritualists now there because they don't they didn't work for it. So they just they carry the money yaputu yaputu yaputu. And that's it. Can you imagine? So Tinubu cannot save the Nigeria again. Thunder fire you, but you said that uh, Igbos are not mature to govern. <laughs> Igbo Kwe who said the uh, Igbos are not mature to govern, no. So the people uh, where come they mature now, see what they don't do. And fear, not, not feel let and call their name. Fear, not feel let and call their names. You are just on your own. Joe, Yoruba Kwe, you are not, you are one of the problems of Nigeria. As an APC supporter, you contributed to the trouble that the Nigerian masses are facing. Uh, thinking we say, uh, Mama, na go sleep, baby. Uh, the picky will say, Mama, no go sleep. He said, eh, you go ni soon. You go ni for you, Baron. Okay, you have been following the wicked and bad set of leaders. You and I know that uh, they cannot even salvage this country from its present predicament. And they will not even allow good men and women of this country to come in. And do the right thing. So we have a good people. We actually have men and women that will do the right thing, but they will not allow them. They will use math to finish them. You say Igbos are not matured. Igbos are not matured. Igbos are not matured. The way they're matured now. See them. See how far they have gone. See how far they have gone. So unfortunate. If it is not a fake Igbo, you will never find peace in your entire life. Will only break with somebody after your boss turn Nigeria to Somalia. Hunger day everywhere in in in, in, in the land, and you are not telling us eh, the good people that are supposed to do the right thing. They are not yet to be born. They are not yet born. Says they are born. They are born. Now you know just you know what I mean. They coming. Mm. <laughs> what kind of a thing is that? Where people? In fact, there are people are not just even speaking nice things to him at all. This job don't knock. No more government free money. Can you now see what the rest Nigerians have been suffering from? 
then what of you are you not a human being and a nigerian it's like a, you are getting your senses back since you have not even gotten any appointment you never get nothing. like i tell you like i said you know now only politician they call it money yafu yafu mm. just they get the money yafu yafu but an ordinary person just they work for the money he go he go feel now he go feel now well because it's hundred thousand and compared to people who are still you know uh, that, uh, uh, billions of naira, they won't they won't say anything now. You know the money no they touch in hand now. Even those who are who think that they have billions of naira, by God's grace, that money they will not use it for good things. Stealing people's health, stealing people's wealth, people's sweat. Now go Colombia. See what is happening to Yayana. See the kind of money they are calling. Who is his father? Which work has he worked in his life to get that kind of money? To get that kind of money. It's like this man is now on the side of Nigeria masses. Yes, so he never get appointments from Tinubu. Just watch. When they give him appointments, the story will change. Of course, it will change. If it were then, if it were when it's a drainage clinic job in Lagos was still inside, he would not have said this so lie lie. Joe is only talking metaphysically. Ask him which generation was he born and how did the generation thrive he is only painting an elusive image to dampen the morals of those ready to make nigeria great again once again we must occupy nigeria the pains and tears you contributed greatly to inflicted on us the anger of god will soon catch up with you people there is no doubt about it there is no doubt about it Yes, yeah, so the dog has gone back to his vomit. So guys, let's say your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you.